Just recently, I had a lot of requests uh, uh, whether a ticketing template that is on the Kenza Marketplace has a functionality similar to uh, Eventbrite. And we decided to fix this gap. And in this video, I will demonstrate you a ticketing template that allows users to create their own events and publish them on a ticketing platform. And these events can then later be sold to some other visitors of this uh, platform or website. So let's start with presentation. Let's assume that I'm just a normal visitor of the website that would like to publish the event. You can see the add event button. I'm hitting on this button and then I'm being redirected to a login uh, register uh, page. So uh, I don't have an account yet and I'm going to provide my email. And once I'm hitting the register button, I can immediately start uh, creating my uh, event. In my case, I'm going to publish uh, how to set up the events management platform online. I'm also providing the description here and uh, setting up the price for this event, uh, providing the featured image and also uh, the date and time when the event starts and when it ends and also the location venue title and uh, the physical address of the event. So when I'm hitting on uh, create event button, my event being created and published to all the website directors. I'm going back to the home page of this template, scrolling a little bit down to the coming soon section. And then I'm hitting on the January uh, 2022, where I published my event to. And here we can see that my event is actually present. I can also try to search my event through the uh, home page banner by just providing a single phrase or a word that uh, links to uh, this event and I'm typing webinar. So here I'm being uh, redirected to the event search page and here we can see that it was successfully found. As the owner of my events, I can also uh, edit some information just in case I find some typo. And uh, what I'm going to do is navigating to events dashboard section and here you can see my uh, event uh, online webinar to set up events management platform and i would like to modify it i'm hitting on edit a link and here i can see basically same layouts same editing layouts as i had before where i can uh, update information about the event you don't want uh, to manage it yourself you can allow your users to update all the information about their events also let's check out how uh, the event looks under the calendar. In this specific example, I'm just trying to find my event by uh, filtering in uh, by location. And my location was Ken's uh, webinar. And here's it. It was successfully found. So uh, let's make a test purchase of this event. I'm hitting on the get ticket button, uh, going to the cart, uh, providing all the necessary information to finish the checkout. And once the checkout is done, uh, you can see that uh, I have an option to download my PDF ticket that has a QR code. So this QR code uh, can be used uh, later on. So for example, someone, you or someone who a third party uh, can also validate this event to make sure that uh, the ticket is used only once. And in order to do that, you can use a free application that is available on the Play Market and called My Ticket Scanner. So here's it, you can see, you just need to install to your Android phone, uh, navigate uh, on top of the QR code, scan and get the additional information. And if this video was useful, like it. And also don't hesitate to reach me and ask any questions through the support page that I was mentioning to you earlier. And also I uh, hope to see you again and thank you for watching.